stop it, eh, go crazy, eh, go stop it. Mom lost her phone, so the crackhead stole her phone. <laughs> Crack my laptop, I don't even know how. Nice chain, red ball man. Chain swing, light pretty thing. You always gonna be looking crazy when I have my glasses on. Girl. Nobody's worried about you. What? I was not here on the radio. Why? Give me a minty ice water and a brownie warmed. What? Warped. Warped. Why don't we welcome to this video? Um, I had this idea last week, and I don't know if I'm still gonna do it. I wanted to do like a spring break weekly vlog, but I didn't know what I wanted to do to like give it a little twist. Dressing monochromatic. I'm gonna be dressing broke. No. I'm gonna be dressing as a monochromatic. Wait. What? I'm gonna be wearing monochromatic outfits this whole week. Yeah. On my main Instagram, I asked you guys to ask us questions, me and her, because you guys always ask for like a drive with me type video. And also, I didn't get any like content for today, so because we didn't really do much today, I pretty much slept the whole day. I tried editing, but like I just I wasn't into it. Now we're gonna do a little Q and A. <laughs> Have y'all ever fist fought each other? Yes. No, she and don't I fight with her hands. She pulls my hair. So. Uh, last time we did that was literally. Oh wait. <laughs> that was literally like a month ago. I know. Anyways, who's more mature? Me. Yeah, I actually think she is more mature, but only in some situations. Like sometimes No, I'm, I'm more mature with like actual issues, but I can I'm just goofy. She's kinda of silly. She's kinda of talk. It feels like I have a ball in my throat. No, it's like immature when it comes to like social interactions. Like she won't go up to the counter and ask for some ranch. I'm not fucking. But she immature has social anxiety, bitch. I'm gonna put all those in because no. then stop cussing. I sound so retarded. <laughs> <laughs> you do. It's a favorite memory with the IE. Oh my yeah. God. I don't talk right now. I sound dumb. <laughs> Have your guys' boyfriends met? No. They're meeting this weekend though. Yeah, tomorrow we're going to Santa Barbara and they have to stay in a hotel together and they've never met, so... I sound so tired. Kind of awkward for them. What do you all fight about the most? It's not a four-way stop, honey. I do. I it's not a four-way stop! Questions are kind of not loading, so... No, I just got a new... Lexus! It's not my fault these people are returning. Mm -hmm. It's crackhead hours. Uh, got a new iPhone yesterday. Why did I say iPhone? I got a new phone yesterday. It's the white or like silver XS Max. Hurry up. My phone is cracked out. Oh, I don't even know if I can eat. Uh, this will not load. This is ruining my whole Q&A segment. You literally hurry up. I think I'm just really impatient. Oh my God. Boy, I know. I'm hella breaking out. For what? Look. Mm. Okay, I guess I'll just talk about my day then. This week I've been in a really weird mood. Like, I feel like I'm usually super motivated, like, to film and edit and all that just because that's how I naturally am. Kinda. This week I've just been feeling really, like, unatta unattached. In detached. Detached. Feeling really detached from like YouTube, not YouTube in general. I don't know why it was just, it's like just specifically this week, or it was last week, not this. Well, kind of both, but I hope this little funk goes away because I'm kind of tired of it. Can my, can I stop being sick? I sound stupid. Go stupid, go crazy, go stupid. It hurts so bad. Oh, actually, so cute. Ew. <gasps> oh my god, is that how mine looks? No, let me see. Just put your tongue down. Is that how the f your tonsils are supposed to look like a line? Good source though, I have strep throat. Oh my god, can I take a picture of it? Okay, can I show? No! Weirdo! No, show them! Okay. That's how it's supposed to look. Look at mine compared to yours. <laughs> That's why I can barely talk, bro. Like, 
Yeah, I'm having like this much space to even push down my food or talk or breathe. She's like, I know. This is so funny to me because I don't know why I was so amused that her throat literally looked so nasty. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. I hope that didn't make you click off. Oh, so big. Can't believe I haven't got crazy. Oh. Dude, when I first saw I was like, oh. I was like, I'm tonsillitis. you. She got tonsillitis though. Remember I was like so against dyeing my hair and then I dyed it because <laughs> I thought it was going to be super damaged. That's why I was against it and I kind of just liked being a natural girl. Like really not that much damage. I think it's just because I got like highlights instead of like bleaching my hair. I think it's something different. Can you different? You're being loud for no reason. I'm breaking out so bad. Just don't look at me. Oh my God. Look at my body shape. Oh my God, my body be like. I Can you stop crunching your bag? Yes. Wait. Bro, you're gonna get Chris sick. I know. <laughs> and he's not sick yet, so. He has a really um strong immune system though. Okay. See y'all at home. So I'm home and I'm gonna give you guys a little outfit of the day because right now I'm gonna get dressed so we can go to the gym. The outfit's kinda cute. I feel like I've worn this before though, but like it's still cute. So this is my fit. I didn't wear this the whole time. I just did it for right now because I look like a boy when it's just like a regular t-shirt. Shirts from Zoomies and then my pants are from Dolls Kill. I actually wanted to try these on. These shoes because I got them a while ago and I never tried them on. So I kind of want to flex for a little bit. Dude, these are literally the biggest shoes I own. Why can't I find the other one? I literally feel like a model in these for no reason. I'm some type of way. I'm kind of sweating right now, but oh, like I'm in like really high heels, but like better. Forever 21 did not have to snap like this. These were like $35, and these are so cute. <laughs> these literally would have been like $70 at Dolls Kill for no reason. Okay, I'm gonna go see what my mom thinks of my shoes. Do you like my shoes? More bueno. Graciosa. You might have a shot in it. Is it? Do not kick me. I'm somebody. I grab it. Grab it. We are. I leave you. Girl, get out of my room. I'm gonna get ready for the gym. Until next time. Um, okay, so a little strange turn of events. I forgot that I had this little two-piece set. I don't know where I got it, so I'll put it on the screen if I remember, but I want to take pictures in it with my shoes. Uh, does this not look like they just go together? Like, I think they were meant to be, so I'll take some little pictures and I'll be back. This is the corduroy jacket that I thrifted, so if you guys are wondering, I got it from Goodwill, so. Mm. I am in so much pain. My toes are literally throbbing right now. I just... I just dropped my phone on my toes right now, and I... This hurts so bad. Ah! I just got back from the gym, and I'm gonna take a shower right now, and then I already actually... Already started packing for Santa Barbara, so... I don't really have anything else to do tonight. I really want to finish the video that I did last week. I need to finish editing it, but... We'll see how that goes. Um, I'll see you guys after my shower. Okay, um... Oh, I can't scratch... Okay, so I'm wearing the Aztec, wait, Indian, the Aztec clay mask. It's on Amazon for like $10. You can get a big tub of it, and it's super, super good. I only use it like once a month. just need a little reset, so I'm wearing this mask. I put Moroccan oil in my hair because, honestly, it's kind of dead. Okay, I put a bunch of treatments and stuff in my hair. My mom got me tacos right now, so I'm going to eat, and I'll show you guys what I packed. So these are my custom shampoo and conditioners. I picked them out the shower because my sister thinks it's okay to use my custom shampoo and conditioner. Um, Y'all hear this? Ugh. Hi guys, so today is... I did my makeup. My facial thing doesn't even work no more. Tuesday, April 16th, and we're leaving to the beach soon, but my mom went to go get us. You're gonna give me copyrighted. It's the remix, the remix. Now my outfit today is red. I got the red heart, and then I 
<laughs> got that bear from the fair and then I put water in here yeah we put a water bottle up it's yeah it was a hole in there yeah all of the fur kept coming out the stuffing it kept coming out so we had to find a solution and then we taped it sounds full he's a little too comfortable like a bunch of random red spots on my face because I put on this overnight a spot treatment and it made it look like that so I'm wearing my locket and then I put on this heart with like red eyeliner because monochromatic I thrifted my shirt and then my pants are from Lupsana and then I'm wearing some fall socks but no hair my dirty Reeboks and he's obviously matching with me this is my new laptop that I was talking about I had to buy these two wires it's like thinner than that one so I want to buy stickers for it so that it could be decorated like how that one was anyways I muted it because nobody is getting copyrighted today, YouTube. Always trying it. What's up, crackheads? <laughs> We're at Target. I don't know why. We're getting my sister's bathing suits because we can't check into our hotel until 3. Can you stop? We got some slushy. He likes to drink all my stuff, so... She was sleeping the whole time. Uh, oh, I was. I got was this little makeup bag because I don't have a makeup bag and every time I go somewhere I don't have anywhere to put my stuff in so I got this. Why are you recording? <laughs> yep, that's the same thing. Is there um, a sermon in this cold water? No. No, he goes to cold. He's literally talking about he wanted to swim the whole time so... Okay, um... That's Alexis and her boyfriend. Do we have to eat at a burger place? Now we're at like this shopping. Mom, is it a shopping center? Just like it. We're kind of at this. Oh my god, what if I dropped my camera? It's like an escalator. Oh, that's cute. Okay. This like shopping center and we're gonna eat dinner and stuff. We just walked on. Can you scrub to me? Um, we went and walked on the beach because we used to have. We used to have a beach house and then we sold it and then we went to go look at it. So I'll insert the picture right here He's kind of cold My feet are cold <laughs> We're eating at this restaurant. It's a burger place Wearing Abilene's merch So we're gonna eat and then we're gonna walk around and shop probably he doesn't want to swim. He thinks it's too cold. He's bus kid. Oh. <laughs> now we're gonna rent some bikes and just like scroll. I mean, scroll, stroll around Santa Barbara. I don't know what exactly we're doing, but we're gonna rent this long bike. I'll show you what it looks like. Hello, long for no reason. And then my cute boyfriend. Go like this, that one? Yeah. He doesn't know how to ride a bike, so... I think I'm gonna have to be leading. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be leading the boat. What are He was breaking the whole time. Renato! Yeah. Okay, so basically never, ever, ever ride a bike with Renato because he'll just keep breaking on you randomly. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we went biking or whatever. It was super stressful, and we were literally at the very back of like our whole line. We're not a really doesn't know how to ride a bike. Let me just say that. I kept like breaking randomly, and then it like messed my whole flow up. But you know, I still love them. So, and after we like finished the whole hour long bike ride, um, my mom realized she lost her phone and it fell out of her pocket while she was pedaling. Only my mom would lose her phone that way. Everybody started stressing out. Everybody like spread around the trail that we had rode on. We're looking for it for like a good 30 minutes and we didn't find it. But keep watching because it gets interesting. Hi, you bring Mary as a gift for photography. No. If you're receiving this message, then most likely my just went biking and it was really hard because it was his first time riding a bike, so he had me do all the work. My mom lost her phone, so then we all went back and like tried looking for it for like 20 minutes. She couldn't find it. Mom's sad. She's kind of sad. Now we're gonna find the hotel, which is like 
Yeah, it's like 30 minutes away because couldn't find a hotel in Santa Barbara that wasn't like a thousand dollars. So, yeah. Okay. Hi so, guys. I've been wearing this all day. Stopped by the sunset and we took like a bunch of Polaroids. Can I see yours? Sisters took some. I got one of Renato and then me and Renato and then me and my mother. Yeah, we stopped by there for like 10 minutes and then we also went to Starbucks. The Starbucks worker knew me and then he gave me a Trenti like size drink instead of Venti, which is what I ordered. So it was hella nice. We're at our hotel right now and I found out that our hotel is really close to American Vintage in Goodwill, so I want to go thrifting tomorrow. And our hotel is one star. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> not gonna fit that in. I, I look like death. It was actually three stars. And we were at the wrong hotel, so. And my mom got a really cheap hotel and it was because it was super last minute and we literally booked it the day before. So, look at this. <laughs> so any hotel that we did get was gonna be like $2,000 a night. So we're really not down for that. Uh, we're just like chilling right here. I don't know why, but update you later. Uh, For a few hours, they oh. asked, I think their phone was dead and they had us charge it. And then he just let us know. Call. Oh, thank you so much. Why would someone drop it off at a Mexican restaurant? <laughs> but this is right. So they got a Pokita and a Lokita right next to each other. I just want to know why. The crackhead stole our phone. <laughs> This is the case I got here. Okay, look, we're- All right, so basically what happened here was actually pretty crazy. Okay, so we were driving to the hotel, right? And then Alexis's boyfriend, he was like, does anybody have her location like on the phone just in case someone charged it or turned it on or whatever? I forgot that she was actually sharing her location with me because I like shared my location with myself on her phone just for future needs. I realized that and then I looked on my phone and like it said that the phone was on because when she lost her phone she said it was dead so no one could really track it then someone turned it on or whatever and charged it and i saw that i actually had her location our hotel was like 30 ish minutes from santa barbara which is where we were bike riding at but we were like already on our way and we thought like some crackhead or like homeless person took it there are a lot of like homeless people in like the venice santa monica area if you've been to venice or santa monica you know that it's like a really really like populated area of that sort we literally thought like a homeless person took it and was like literally just chilling at the park with it in that clip you saw that it was like this whole green area and it was like right there so i thought like someone was just chilling at the park with it we all thought that we were literally gonna have to like fight for the phone from like a homeless person but then literally like five minutes before we were gonna get there someone called my dad and it was actually this mexican restaurant that was super close to like where we were bike riding she called him she was like hey i seen this number on the phone and i wanted to let you know that we have the phone someone turned it in that you can like come pick it up and we we're like we we're kind of shook it. Yeah, that's the story of that. We were like so shocked because we were literally already on our way and then she called us at like the perfect time. So, you know, the story ended well. I actually brought my whatever that is. Um, I brought this backpack. I actually bought one because I got one for a giveaway and then I just thought, you know, mine as well. I don't really know how much I like it yet. It was $80, so I don't really know yet. We went to Paxton today, so I'm gonna show you guys what we got. That is right here. So Renata got, Renato got this Playboy shirt. It's kind of just like a button-up type shirt. I don't really know. Got this like really cute pastel light green shirt from like the Brandy Mebel section. I got these like thick gold hoop earrings. They were like cute and I wanted to put earrings in my ears. So I got something from Lush. I'll show you because I had to put it in the fridge because they told me to like put it in the fridge like within 24 hours. So it kind of got me scared. So I mean like this little one. I kind of wanted the big one, but I got cupcake like this facial cleanser slash like treatment type thing basically it said that it helps with like soothing redness and it also helps with like oily skin so you know i kind of had to buy it like <clears throat> something's wet right there i just finished editing this 42 minute video that i made last week i don't even think that it's gonna export because it keeps saying like it's still referencing media and it's really getting on my nerves because it's Took me literally like four days to edit that, so I'll update you later. My stomach, I'm good. <laughs> it feels better like this now. I feel cold. Okay, so I'm picking out my outfit for tomorrow and then my swimsuit because I want to go swimming tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> boy. Oh, I put on the earrings. But I'm gonna get ready for bed and then I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Hey, baddies. So this is Renato. He's wearing the shirt. He looks so good. Anyways, oh.
Hey guys, so I'm back again. I know this is getting really annoying, but me and Renato actually tried that cupcake mask that I got from Lush. It was actually pretty good. It made my face soft. It wasn't anything out of the ordinary, so... Yeah, thought I would give a little review. Also wanted to say that me and Renato were not in the same hotel room. We booked two rooms for Chris and Renato and then like my family in another room. So I just want you guys to know that because my mom does not let that stuff go down. But yeah, so carry on. You know where the lotion's at? Boy, I don't think we got lotion. I'll give you an outfit of the day later. So not a, we're all just getting ready because we're gonna leave at 11 because our checkout time is at 12. It's 11 01 and I was just getting ready. Like, I did concealer and powder and I put on freckles. And I'm gonna do my makeup, like my mascara right now, and then I'm gonna be done. But Lex is still getting ready, and then started my lady days. Lady days. Lady days, not good, I but. Just, just. So now I can't swim, which I wanted to swim, and now I can't go in the ocean, which I also wanted to do, but. I mean, I guess it's fine now, I guess. Also, I got four hours of sleep because Vicky's big self don't know how to sleep right, so. Yesterday, we were going on a hunt for my mom's phone because when we were bike riding, she lost her phone like it fell out her pocket, apparently. This is my outfit. Today's color is green, obviously. Delia's little striped top from Doll's Kill. And then my pants are from Tilly's. So we're at breakfast right now. We're at Pete's breakfast house. We're in a house. Come on. My turn. <laughs> Pete's breakfast house. Okay. <laughs> and stuff like picture frames <gasps> Whoa. oh my god this Okay, hi, I'm wearing like this grandma shirt, so don't mind that, hopefully. So I really don't remember the last time I vlogged. I'm just gonna give you like a little rundown of what we just did in the past few, basically like what we did the whole day, because I don't think I vlogged that much today. Shirt is really distracting me, like it's kind of ugly. Literally 10.35 right now, because we got home like an hour-ish ago. Basically, we woke up, we went to that thrift store, and then we went and ate breakfast, and then we went to two more thrift stores. I was in so much pain. I didn't vlog that much because I literally, like, I... If you're a girl, you know how it feels. Like, I was cramping so bad I didn't have any medicine. Like, I was really on the verge of death. That's what it felt like. Just kind of not in the best mood. Like, Renato, I feel really bad for him because he had to go through that. We went to American Vintage and then we went to Goodwill. Goodwill was super big. I really liked that thrift store. I was just feeling really bad, so I didn't really, like, thrift the way I wanted to. Like, I didn't really find, like, really, really good stuff. And then American Vintage, I don't know why I thought American Vintage was a whole different store. I thought that American Vintage was, like, a clothing store, but it was, like, expensive. I was, like, thinking of, like, this really cool, like, L.A. type store, you know? Like, I've seen this store and, like, other people people's vlogs and I was like oh they have one in Ventura but it was like something totally different super old like hella vintage stuff we were in there it was just kind of like weird vibes like I don't really know how to explain it like you'd have to be there to know what I'm talking about even my dad was telling me when we left he was like I couldn't be in there it was like weird vibes like it was like weird bad energy you know I kind of like felt that like I've never felt that in any other store but like it just made me feel like anxious and like uneasy like it made Renato feel hella anxious I don't know what it was that made us feel like that. Everything was super, super, like, there was so much going on. Now, that store was just kind of weird. I wasn't really with it. I didn't get anything. Renato got something, though. He got these two albums. 
which he's not here anymore. He, he left like 20 minutes ago, so plus I was in pain. I was aching, so like that just made it worse. Then we left there and we went to Venice. We just chilled for like a couple of hours. I think we were there for like three or four hours. Me and Renato were like on the beach. We were walking the little Venice boardwalk thing. And Renato got this little monkey. I don't remember if I got anything, but we just like ate and everything. Just basically walking by like the souvenir shops and like all the um places to eat and stuff like that so i really needed to change so me and renato were gonna look for like a starbucks or like a mcdonald's nearby so we can walk to it so that i can change in one of the bathrooms because if you've ever been to venice venice beach it has the nastiest restrooms there are so many people there there are a lot of like homeless people there restrooms are nasty so i didn't want to use them sorry I'm not like spoiled or anything but they're like really nasty literally no restrooms anywhere so we we're looking and then renato found a starbucks so like i said we were walking on like the little venice like boardwalk thing where all the souvenir shops and everything was it's just like this long strip so this was the venice boardwalk and then a little bit up there was like a parking lot that we were in Renato literally walked all the way around just to find out that the starbucks was literally on the venice boardwalk we did a whole detour for no reason I'm so scared that we were gonna get snatched up because like it was just super sketchy and like sus like i don't know how to explain it unless you're there i'm kind of scared and this is also super super crowded like it's like really really yeah and then we finally left venice and then we went to another starbucks they didn't have a bathroom we went to mcdonald's and i changed or whatever and then i got food and there was this homeless man outside of the mcdonald's and he asked me for money and i didn't have any cash so then i went back inside to buy him food and then when i got out he wasn't there yeah so my sister just ended up eating his food but but yeah i kind of felt bad about it the whole time because i feel like i could have been a little bit faster but then on the drive home i just slept the whole way so that was kind of the summary of today i'm sorry i didn't vlog that much like i said i'm gonna give you a little haul of the stuff that i got from the thrift stores we went to this really really cool thrift store it was like super cool super vintage it was so chill and i like i love the people there i found some really cool stuff that i usually wouldn't find at like any other thrift store so i got this like floral shirt i don't know it's just like a regular little tee i don't know how i feel about it i think it just really reminds me of spring and i really like all the colors and stuff and renato said he likes it so it was renato approved Approved. this got all bent up i got this random little like purple bucket thing it was literally i think like 13 cents i don't know just a random bucket and has these cute ribbons and it's purple i don't know i thought it was cute i just got a lot of random stuff i got this little cute little picture frame i want to print out a picture and put a picture in here but um, super cool like there's just a lot going on i just love how this looks it's super cute it's like all my favorite colors and i've never seen something like this so i got this super fancy spoon it looks like this i feel like it like doesn't really mean anything like i feel like it's not monumental or like at all it's in like a glass cabinet so it made it look like it was like worth value even though it was like two dollars now we're gonna move on to what i got from goodwill goodwill was actually really nice i just didn't really look like i wasn't really in the mood first thing i got was this orange like sporty looking top the white little detailing i don't know this looks super sporty I like how bright colored this is so i can like wear this with just like some I don't even know, but I originally picked this off for Renato, but he kind of declined my offer, so I took it for me. I just got this Nike green tee. That's pretty much all it is. I'm just really into the color green right now. It's no big deal. So Renato actually picked this out. I don't it says tan is right there, and it's like this brownish, like light brown tan color. Oh, wait, or is it yellow? Eh, I can't really tell. That's everything that I got from today. Thank you for watching the haul and listening to my mini story times that really don't matter. I'm back home now, so our little vacation is over, but we're going somewhere on Friday with Renato and like... So I just got two packages. That one's from Brandy Melville and that one is from Urban Outfitters. Probably just show you guys what I got tomorrow because I'm actually going to do a haul because Doe actually like, you know, kind of paid for that stuff in a way. Yeah, so that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow, which is... Thursday. Bye. Hey baddies. So it's April 18th and it's 11:42 right now in the morning. And I'm gonna get my ears pierced, but I don't think I'm gonna vlog that on this vlog because I'm doing a transformation video, which I've been doing for literally like three weeks. I'm so I want to get it over with, but I didn't end up getting it over with. Right now I'm doing a face mask. I'll show you which one it is. It's called Black. That's the brand. I just took this disgusting wellness shot, which you'll see in my transformation video. Basically, it's just like a shot that you take. It's like supposed to like juice cleanse you. It's like super healthy and whatnot. And it made my tongue orange, so. I also put on this Jergen stuff to like natural tan. I don't really know if it's gonna work, but we'll see if Jergens is a flop. Right now I'm gonna go live on Doe. It's 11.44 and I'm gonna go on live at 12. I, I kinda have a lot of things to do. I wanna check the mailbox. Duh.
ship some things out. I want to go to the mall to get like some Easter things. I want to get like my family presents for like Easter, like make them all their own Easter baskets. So I'm planning on doing that. I don't know if we're going to do it. Oh, I really want to film today and I also want to hang out with my friend. So we'll see if all that happens. Like, I'm going to get ready on dope. So the next time I'll see you, I'll probably get be ready and like not look like this. Um, I'll see you guys. So I just got ready on dough and I want to film a playlist video right now because I also need to do a sponsorship so it'll like work in perfectly. So I was going to film that right now but I checked the mailbox right now so. This is mine. Oh. This is mom. Hey okay anyways so a bunch of stuff came and you guys always want me to do like unboxings so I guess I'll unbox them for you like. So first thing I got from Amazon Prime. Hey, first thing I got were these things, these colorful little strand things that you can just clip onto your hair. I'm going to use these for an upcoming video. I also got my clear case, finally, because my phone has been naked this whole time, so she has some clothes. This is nice. What is this? Is this remove protective film? I don't know where it is, though. This looks so dumb. Well, that was kind of difficult for no reason, but I always accidentally like show my address on my unboxing, so I'm just not gonna open it in front of the camera anymore. This is my mother's. She keeps ordering like printed leggings in my name. I think someone's using my cord. Oh. <gasps> this brand, Catpiff on Instagram, they sent me this cute shirt. Oh my god, this is really cute. I think I'm gonna wear this. <gasps> is this from. Oh, I ordered these jeans from Paxson. Look like this, and they're like two-toned jeans. They're super cool. It's like this really nice. Actually, the first package that I opened, and there's some Nike Air Forces. This company actually reached out to me. I'll put their at on the screen. It's called like Drip Creations or something like that. It's super cool. They make like a bunch of like custom Air Forces vans, like pretty much anything you want. And they made me some custom Air Force. Oh. <laughs> like some regular air forces but they like painted on some butterflies they're so nice they're literally the nicest shoes ever thank you so much to drip creations who sent them to me i don't want to wear these today for like my monochromatic look even though blue is just kind of not the wave um oh my god these are so cute this really cool phone case company it's called little vola i'll leave it on the screen they have the coolest most different like i love their cases they actually reached out to me like i think like two months ago and i love their cases so they sent me a few more um my thing is when i ordered these i had my old like iphone 8 plus so now i have this phone and i mean that's kind of my fault but sent me this cool strawberry case i actually picked all these out this is so nice i really like this case i wish i want to get more but like in my actual phone size this is such a pretty color and then they sent me this strawberry one they sent me this really cool gold reflective one i saw this and i thought it was super cool because this used to be a trend i remember a lot of people had cases like this and I, this is such a pretty color ah! there's desmond Trotter right there and it's this really pretty shade of pink this is so pretty why did i get this in the wrong phone such a pretty color it matches my headband and then the last one i got is in the same green color i actually had this color before but it like cracked so i got a new one and it is such a pretty color literally the prettiest case i've ever had so yeah i have a bunch of like solid color cases like this and you can customize them and they have so many different colors muddy body the skincare brand actually sent me something they said they sent me a mask i don't know what mask they sent me but i love the little package they send so much stuff going out of this box so they sent me the muddy magic clay mask it looks like this it's called the magic mask and it has blueberry rosemary and lemon i've never heard of this mask i think this is like a new one but I cannot wait to try this i love masks from muddy body so those are all the packages that i got right now I cannot wait to wear the air forces i think i'm gonna wear them today and like have like a blue fit so we'll see if i actually end up doing that so you guys when i do something because i'm about to film and then me and my sister are gonna do a drive with me and then we're gonna go to the mall so i'll see you then all right so what time is it Okay, whatever. It's 1.57 right now, so it's like 2 o'clock. I just finished getting ready, and so did I, so we're gonna head to the mall and do the drive with me right now. I'll show you my little fit. I actually really like it. I think this is super cute. So don't come for me. I know the denim jacket is so ugly just because, like, 
they don't they don't coordinate it's just ugly i'm not confident enough to just wear this tube top out by itself this is my monochromatic fit for today i'm wearing this butterfly tube top from cyberspace shop on depop I'm wearing my blue dickies from dolls kill i'm pretty sure and the custom air forces these are so nice again go check them out at drip creations really my favorite shoes now they are so pretty there's something on my camera on this denim jacket because I'm kind of, you know, not confident enough to wear this tube top out by itself. So we'll see how I feel when we get there. I'm going to try to vlog at the mall as much as I can. I don't know how much I will, but we'll see. I just did this. And I'm not feeling it, so I'm taking it off. I wanted to do a little bit of eyeshadow to, like, you know, spice up the look. It didn't really... I don't know. I'm going to try to do something else, and we'll see how it looks. You can... Oh, <laughs> this is so bright. How did I kind of look like a cracky? This is the BH Cosmetics X Daisy Marquez palette. This is this shade right here in Honey. Kind of snapped. Like, I don't know if I'm going to wear it though because it's so bright that it's kind of blinding. Oh. Why are you salty? <laughs> Um, okay, so right now we're- my con is so much better. <laughs> okay, let me see your Sony. <laughs> so we're trying to film a drive with me, but we're both just kind of boring though. Like, we don't really know what to talk about because she doesn't want to make a playlist video because she doesn't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> we tried doing questions, but all my questions are trash. Uh -huh. And she got one question. <laughs> all of a sudden, we just got a pink drink. I don't know if we're gonna go to the mall anymore because oh. we're gonna go to the mall anymore because I really don't know what I want to get yet. Like I should have pre-planned what I was gonna get from the mall, but now I just don't know, really know. I have my boyfriend in here. He's so cute. Keep you updated. We still need to make a video for her channel. So let's do a mukbang. Let's do it. Okay, we're here at Z Valley Plaza Mall. I forgot I'm like in public. I've been wanting to get my ears pierced, but I can't right now because Alexis isn't over 18. Okay, I'm gonna get my sisters a Polaroid because they've been asking for one. Okay, so I don't know if I want to get them the blue one, the pink one, or the green one. All on sale right now for 50, they're usually 70, so I think I am gonna get them their own. Oh! So I'm back home now from the mall. It's 5-11. I think we were there for like two hours. So I got a bunch of stuff for like Easter, like presents for my family and things like that. So I got this little Claire's choker. I got that for a video. I don't actually think it's cute, but it's for a video. You'll see what it is. I got these like flower pins. I don't know. I thought they were cute and you know, kind of classy. This tripod because this tripod is kind of trash. Always kind of like sabotages my camera. Like I feel like it wants my new camera to break. So I'm just kind of done with it. $23 and it looks really cool cool so i thought i would give it a try and then i went to zoomies i don't really go to zoomies that often but when i went there they had some cute stuff so i've been so into the color green i got this green tube top i don't know it's cute and it's green i've been wanting a green tube top but i got this purple adidas little tank for summertime and it's like my favorite color so what'd you guys talk about in your driving room? oh move can y'all get out like literally just to upload the footage my card reader i'm gonna show you guys what i got my family just because i know this video is going to be uploaded after easter my sisters these water balloons i also got them like a bunch of snacks but i don't really need to show you that i got them each their own polaroid i'm really excited because they've been wanting one and they've been asking for one both of them i need to get them filmed still but yeah i got them the polaroids from mac got my mom a gift card and then because this is like her favorite makeup place this is like the only place i see her buying makeup I got her a gift card and then i got her this new perfume i didn't know mac had perfume but it's called Candy Yum Yum, and my mom loves perfume, so. I don't really want to take it out because it's not interesting, but it's got my dad some new basketball shorts. Last place I went was Claire's, and these little Easter bunny, like, ear type things. I don't really know. I thought they were cute. They were, like, $10 each, and they had, like, a three-for-three three sale. I got these cute little diaries for them. I didn't really know what to get them just because everything there was, like, kind of cringy, and I didn't really want my sisters to have to go through that, you know? Mickey, this little bunny diary, and then I got Rachel a ladybug one. I don't really know why, but, you know. That's everything I got from the mall, so I'll probably update you when we do something else. I think right now I either want to edit or just watch some videos and chill because... 
see you later it is it so it's 1 11 and it's friday today it's the last day of this vlog i'm actually kind of happy though because i feel like i've been vlogging my whole life but kind of have i actually got this new tripod and i tried it yesterday with my big dslr camera there that was really hard for no reason I tried it and it's actually pretty good it's just kind of difficult because my dslr is super big you know it's like a heavy camera so i don't know if this little thing can hold on to it um right now i'm gonna do my makeup it's like one o'clock but we're also i forgot to tell you guys that we're actually going to a soccer game today carson city if you know where that is i don't even know where that is watching la galaxy versus houston dynamo um, the glossier the glossier priming moisturizer if you're wondering um okay so i'm back here i couldn't really talk i was like hella stuttering and it was really getting on my nerves so i just stopped talking just got dressed because why did i no just got dressed today's little monochromatic color is pink because i've been so into the color pink like for no reason i think i'm just kind of feminine now so it's really no big deal like y'all i'm gonna do my hair and makeup soon me and my sister are gonna refilm the drive with me because yesterday the camera's kind of on crack and it didn't really like record so now we have to refilm it which is kind of annoying but yeah i also need to mail some things off like my past three giveaways i still need to mail that stuff off i want to go get strawberries to make chocolate covered strawberry kind of the plan for today and then i'm gonna go to the game and yeah so i'm gonna show you guys my outfit because i'm actually kind of proud of it like i'm wearing this shirt from cat piff apparel on instagram go check them out I'm wearing this white belt from princess polly and then i'm wearing these pink dicky shorts as you can see i got them from urban outfitters on dough i'm gonna be doing a haul on my main channel so just look out for that so i have this fat pimple right here that really just doesn't want to go away then i'm wearing my custom vans that i made in like eighth grade and that's when i was really obsessed with pink and red so kind of matches perfectly see you then um hi guys so i'm kind of like almost ready vlog because i wanted to try out these lash brats eyelashes she sent me them so go check them out on instagram they're called um, that's what they're called so go check them out i don't know which ones i want to wear they sent me three different kinds let me all of these i think i'm gonna do these just because they look the most natural these are like very big and flared out i decided to do eyeshadow today because i feel like i never do eyeshadow and plus pink is like the only eyeshadow color that i can actually do correctly so I use the venus xl palette by lime crime this is like my favorite palette of like pinks because it has like pretty much pink colors on the lashes and i'll be back i'm kind of being rushed right now because it's already 2 24 and we're actually leaving to the game which takes two hours to get there so we're leaving at like four ish finished the lashes are actually really nice i accidentally put them on wrong the first time but you know, I kind of fixed my mistake. Oh, so, 10 out of 10, recommend these lashes. Okay, so I'm going to ship off this, and then I'm going to ship off one of my merch backpacks. And then I did a giveaway a while ago, and gave away the Jeffree Star brushes and the Anastasia Rivera palette. Exodus is going to do a, a drive with me right now, so I can't use my camera, but yeah, that's what we're doing. It is so hot outside. No, but these lashes feel really heavy and I forgot how like heavy lashes feel. Like another reason why I want to get lash extensions because my friend Alyssa got them and she said that they were really lightweight, so we just went to Dollar Tree and then we also went to Subway. Got like a whole bunch of candy and baskets for my little sisters. Then we went to Subway and I got a tuna sandwich and she got an Italian BMT. <laughs> it's funny. I love these cheeks. No, my eyelashes. I forgot to do my freckles today. Uh! Now I just uploaded two videos onto my vlog channel that were old from my main channel, so I'm just re-uploading them. But they're kind of trash quality, but it's fine. It's I have no service. Okay, whose fault is that? <laughs> We're on our way to the game. It's taking two and a half hours to get there. I decorated my laptop with some stickers, but I cracked my laptop. I don't even know how. He told me I cracked it, kind of rude. I don't know how I did that because I never cracked my old laptop and I had that for like nine months. Literally saw it and then I thought like my screen was dirty and then Renata was like, I think you cracked your screen. And I was like, I know you're lying. I know you're lying. And I did crack it, so I actually have insurance on it. I paid $300 for it. Actually, my mom made me, but... So I'm gonna get it fixed. Don't worry. Ding. These look like, like, horse... Yeah, hey, horse hooves. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know that was what it's called, but... Stop talking about your... But... 
Whoa. Wait, we're not, we need to get out and take pictures. Hold on. We want tacos. He's not a real Peruvian. He can't handle the chili verde. It's not even chili verde. Boy, what is it? He can't handle the chili. home now i need to show you this because i've been obsessing over these for like the past hour and a half <laughs> one of the cutest shoes i've ever seen in my life playboy cow printed like platform shoes is that not me like I'm just kind of jealous that they're not mine but i found some on depop and they're 185 dollars they look like this they're pretty much the exact same ones that I saw and they're 185 and they're size 6.5 which I'm a 7 but you know I get what I get they're so cute and I just don't know if I want to drop $185 for these shoes but I think I might have to we just got home it was like a two and a half hour drive it was super long and super boring but I wanted to update you because these lashes are so nice again they look like this they're called lash to brat this is actually one of my favorite eyelash companies now because these look so good like even after I think like oh long like nine hours of them being on like she kind of snapped for no reason usually when I wear my Ardell ones like they don't even last this long so I'm kind of shook right now I didn't know what I was missing ew I hate when I'm like am I like a mind reader like no I'm gonna get ready for bed now. Um, tomorrow I think I'm gonna get my nose done with my friends. So I'll my I don't know if I'm gonna vlog tomorrow. Like I'm really not sure. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. Um, I really just want to do like a chill weekly vlog. Like it really didn't have much to do with the monochromatic outfits. I kind of just wanted to throw that in. Basically just like my spring break vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If y'all want me to do more of these, I definitely want to do more of these like in the summertime and just in the summertime thank you so much for watching why did i just ramble for four minutes but oh Ew. bye baddies